Oh, Jorgen, this cake my sister-in-law baked is so delicious. Would you like some? No, I just had a very large lunch. I'm too full to eat any more. Okay then, all the more for me. Hi, I'm Paul, he is Jojin, and welcome to One Minute English with Spivartic Language School. Today I am wearing my Chinglish hat, which means we'll be taking a look at a typical mistake a Czech person might make when speaking English. What's the difference between so and to when they are used to emphasize how good or bad something is? So can be used for positive and negative things. But two can only be used for negative things. Let's look at some examples. At the beginning of this video, I said that this cake is so delicious. That's an example of so being used to emphasize something positively. The man's car was so dirty that his wife refused to travel with him in it. That's an example of so being used to emphasize something negatively. Now remember, to can only be used for negative things. For example, I quite liked Venice, but it was a bit too touristy for me. Or, Tony, my girlfriend's left me. She says I'm too smelly. Oh, sorry to hear that, Dad. Don't you use deodorant? No. Hang on. What's this? It's some blue cheese. I bought this weeks ago. Mm. Still good. So, for positive and negative things, too, only for negative things. Thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe. See ya.